everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm gonna be sharing everything that I highly, highly, highly recommend picking up during the Sephora sale. Um, there's perfume in here, there's body care, hair care, makeup, skincare, everything in here. These are all the products that I already use, that I love, that I like literally highly recommend okay these are just like I picked my favorite stuff okay and then I'm gonna be sharing the stuff that is currently in my cart that I will be picking up during this Sephora sale there's about over a grand of stuff in that in my cart right now so I'm definitely gonna take things out but I'm just gonna show you guys my entire cart which it would be like my wish list, um, and, but I might actually pick up everything on there. Anyways, these are the stuff that I highly recommend. I'm just gonna just jump into the video and share with you guys. Okay, so these two uh, hair care products, these are two hair masks that I, mm, I love them. This is the Moroccan Oil Intense Hydrating Mask. I love this, I've used this like so many like times, like, I literally, I don't know why I keep the plastic in there, but it is, I, I love this mask and I, I can feel my hair being so hydrated and smooth the next day and then I'm obsessed with this Olaplex. Mm, I've been using this for such a long time and I like to think that this is the reason why my hair ha is able to withstand all the heat that I do to it. So I highly recommend this product. Okay. So the next thing I wanted to share is body care. So these are two body care products that I love. I have KP on my body. I have it like it, it, on my back and it's actually cleared up a lot. Um, I still have it in my arms. I feel like the arms are a lot harder, but these two products are highly recommend. This is the KP, uh, I don't know how to do this. Okay, this is actually for KP. It's called KP Duty. It is um, a physical and chemical exfoliator and I'm telling you guys, this stuff, it's like I'm almost finished with it so I might pick this up again. This is amazing. I only use it once a week and it feels great. So you can use it every day and I kind of want to pick up another one and use it every day to see if that'll like how that will work but I think it'd be too much actually. Um, anyways, the other, product, the other product that I have is Necessaire the Body Exfoliator. Oh my god, this stuff, I, I don't know, I still have a lot of it, so I might not pick this up again, but this is amazing. It is, a again, a chemical and physical exfoliator. Both of these products that I mentioned as the body exfoliators, they have like lactic acid, glycolic acid, all of these acids that I typically do on my skincare for my face, there are in body care as well. And, and I've actually been adding a lot of lotions and serums on my body that have chemical ingredients, that chemical exfoliating ingredients, and I've seen such a difference. So I highly recommend trying those two out. Okay, so the next thing I wanted to go to, oh, while we're in hair care, the next thing is the Bumble and Bumble Hairdressers Invisible Oil. This is a UV protection, so it gives you like protection when you're outside, but it also has a really great, you know, thermal protection. So you can use this when you blow dry your hair, straighten your hair, and everything. And there's also like oils and everything in here. I on, uh, honestly, I really love this product and I highly recommend giving this giving this a try. It, it has done wonders for my hair. Okay, so jumping on to skincare, I highly recommend the New Face tool. This tool has changed the game for me. I, not only is it so relaxing to do this in my routine, I mostly do this like honestly three times a week, but I highly recommend it. I do feel like it does like tighten up my skin and I do see a difference and it's a micro device. So it basically uh, contracts the muscles to in your face that will tighten up your skin and honestly, it works wonders. It is not a gimmick at all. I do want to say that I don't like the other attachments that it came with. I did buy the one for the eye and lip area. I honestly just like this one. And I, if, you, if you're if you deciding, definitely pick this up. Also, their new face gel primer. I ended up getting the gel primer. I was trying to avoid not purchasing this, but from the reviews I read, I wasn't, I, I didn't really like any of the other options that I could use. Apparently you can use this with aloe vera, uh, but I didn't like the way that felt for some reason. So I'm, I just stuck to new face and I bought this and you can get the big one during the Sephora sale. So if you do have a new face, I highly recommend buying this. So jumping on to uh, serums, I highly recommend getting a lactic acid serum. If you don't already 
like are not using like a chemical exfoliator i highly recommend my favorite one is lactic acid out of all of them it's gentle i have dry skin and i honestly have seen such a difference and these both have a lot of, well good genes has lactic acid in it it is a lactic acid treatment out of both of them the pharmacy honeymoon glow i prefer the good genes and i tried both of them and i honestly i just this is just it for me and i'm going to pick up the big size during the sephora sale this time this is the one that I love the most, but Honey Moon Glow, I believe, has different AHAs on here as well, and it, it works well. There's AHAs and BHAs on here, I believe, but it works really well, and I also like this one, but if you're looking for something that is just gonna, you know, I like my things to work. This, this is it, okay? Okay, so as far as eye cream, I really like this First Aid Beauty Retinol Eye Cream, and for... For First Aid Beauty, I also like their moisturizer. This is their classic moisturizer. It has collodial oatmeal in it, and oatmeal is really good for sensitive dry skin that has redness, and I have redness on my cheeks. And then this eye cream has retinol. I love using an eye cream at night that has retinol. I feel like it's the most effective. You don't really need, honestly, if you're just using a regular eye cream that has no active ingredients in it, you can just use your face moisturizer in that area, but if you're using an eye cream that has retinol, it I highly it's like a different ball game. Like it, you would need like a different product in it because it is formulated for to be safe around your eyes. But this one has hyaluronic acid and retinol, and I I I feel like it's definitely helped with like darkness under my eyes and like those little fine lines. I feel like they're I'm not getting more or I am not um, or they're like slightly going away I have no idea okay but I've seen a difference the other thing I wanted to recommend is the super goop zinc screen 100% mineral lotion this stuff is amazing it's like brown girl friendly it like works really well on me I love mineral sunscreen and this I think this is a perfect one under your face it's hydrating it feels like I'm literally putting on a really moisturizing lotion as opposed to like some sunscreens being really like, I don't know, in the past I've tried like the worst sunscreens. I've been using sunscreen since I was actually like in high school. So I've tried like a lot of yucky stuff on my face and that feels amazing. So because today is Halloween, I don't know if I've mentioned that, today is Halloween. I have, I have no plans, but um, I do have a plan of later on pampering myself. And actually in the month of October, I've been using a lot of these uh, of these, these two face masks. They're pumpkin. Uh, this one's the Peter Thomas Roth pumpkin enzyme mask. And I've used a lot of it, but I'm definitely going to continue to use this in November. And then this is the Summer Fridays. Also, their overtime pumpkin mask. I love both of them. I do think this one is a little bit more stronger. More actives on here. I believe this is like more like clean beauty, but it's also like more of a the consistency is different. It is much more creamier. I'll just show it to you guys. So it's a lot more creamier, whereas this is a lot more... Oh my god. Maybe I should just do a separate video on these two. This is a lot more uh, harder. So like, I don't know how to explain it, but th this feels a lot more creamier and this feels a lot more... When I rub this on my face, I actually feel like I'm doing like a a deep exfoliating like I get a little tingly feeling whereas the summer Fridays I feel like it's hydrating and it doesn't really do a, like a lot of exfoliating at least for me it does not okay okay so then oh my god did I just okay sorry guys I am back and then another thing that I recommend picking up it is the summer Fridays jet lag mask Mwah. this mask is literally it for me it I have dry skin like if you have dry skin this is gonna be your new favorite moisturizer or like face mask especially for the fall and the winter you're gonna love this product okay at first I was like okay she's an influencer this might be gimmicky no this stuff is amazing I have dry skin and I honestly feel such like hydration and my skin feels amazing after I use this I leave it on all night sometimes. I'll like use it as a moisturizer and a primer. Like you, you can put this under your, around your eye area. Like it's safe to like leave it on like with under makeup all day, all night. This is just you can use this in so many different ways. Out of all of the summer Friday masks, 
to be completely honest, I recommend this one, and this one's my favorite out of all of them. Like, yeah, I used the pumpkin one during the October to, like, be cute and everything, but, like, really, this is just, like, my favorite one out of all of them. Okay, so for makeup, I highly recommend this, the Clinique Even Better Foundations. I have the Even Better, this is just the Clinique Even Better. I finished it, and then I went ahead and picked up the Clinique Even Better Glow at Ulta the other day, and I, I love these foundations. I They're my favorite. Um, I don't know, I just like the way that I know it. All, they, they, they both have like vitamin C and sunscreen in it, so it's giving me added protection. And I'm a big fan of makeup that has like skincare benefits, if that makes sense. Okay, so the next thing I have is this Stella eyeliner. This eyeliner is literally amazing. I'm actually not wearing it today, but this is like, this is my favorite eyeliner. And if you can pick it up during the Sephora sale, why not? It is the Stella All Day, the Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner Micro Tip. Amazing, okay? I love this. The other thing I wanted to show you guys are some eyeshadow palettes. I've been using these eyeshadow palettes forever, and I'm literally, like, I'm still gonna use them just because they look ugly and busted. I'm, I'm still gonna use them. So it is a soft glam Anastasia palette. Clearly I've like, yes, I love it. If you just, if honestly, if you burnt orange, literally, if you if you don't wanna get this entire palette, just get that one color burnt orange because I think I'm gonna do that if I can. This, this palette is honestly my favorite. I use it every day. I actually use it today, I think. But yeah, I love this. I use this all the time. The next pro the next eyeshadow palette is this one by uh, Natasha Den Den Denona. I hope I say that right. It's Natasha Denona. I love how compact this is. I, it broke, obviously. But these are the colors that are in it. And honestly, I love how compact it is because I used to when I did work in the office, now I work remote, but when I would actually commute, I would actually do my makeup right when I got to work in the parking lot, and this was perfect because it fit in my makeup bag, so if you are if you like to have your makeup on the go, this is just like the perfect little compact situation with like the best colors that you can wear every day. Okay guys, so for this section here, it is about perfumes, and honestly, if you are a big perfume girl like me. If you can get it for 20% off, you know how expensive perfumes are. So I highly recommend picking it up during the Sephora sale. For me, I love the Gucci Envy Me. This is just a classic. I've actually been using this since I was in the eighth grade, I believe. This was like my first perfume that my dad like took me and my older sister to the mall. And I, I remember she wanted a perfume and I ended up getting this. It's, a, it's actually a pretty strong perfume and maybe not good for a young girl. But I've been using this and my mom actually gets it for me every birthday. And it, oh, it smells so amazing. I remember everyone like can, this scent, like everyone knows it's like me. It just like, it's just my signature smell. And I absolutely love it. And at one point, I was really scared that it was going to go d get discontinued. It is the Gucci Envy Me. Nothing smells like this, okay? It's so refreshing and nice and good for, like, really, like, every day, but also really nice for, like, holiday, like parties and everything like that. The next thing is Alien. This is just, like, perfect for the fall and winter. This is my go-to. That and my Jo Malone perfume are, like, my wintry fall perfume so I highly recommend giving this a try if you haven't already this is like my favorite for the fall I don't know it just takes me to that time okay. all right guys so that is everything that I highly highly recommend picking up during the Sephora sale like these are my favorite things in the world okay like I'm looking at everything here that I curated here and I'm like it's bringing me so much joy because I know it'll bring you joy as well all right guys, so I'm just gonna quickly go down through everything that's in my current Sephora cart that I'm picking up during the Sephora sale, okay? So I'm picking up the Bumble and Bumble Invisible Oil Conditioner. I'm getting the hairdresser size, the 32 ounce one. Like, clearly I am obsessed with this conditioner. It is the best conditioner, it's so hydrating. It's for dry to very dry hair. Like, this is it, this is the best. Um, I'm picking up the Nurse Jamie Beauty Roller. Um, sometimes at night I have a bunch of serums in my skin and I just want to, you know, have those seep into my skin and just massage my face without having to use the new face and the gel. So the next thing I'm going to get, it is the Dyson straightener. My straightener is like five years old and it like turns off in the middle of it. 
I don't know if I'm getting this for sure yet. It's like a good 70% chance, but I need a straightener and I love Dyson products, so it's a good good chance I'm picking this up. The next thing I'm gonna get is the Dior Lip Glow Oil. I love their rosewood lipstick thing that they have, so I'm definitely gonna pick up the oil. I think it'll be perfect for the winter to hydrate my lips and give me some color. All right, guys, so the next thing that I'm gonna get, it is the SK2 Facial Essence. This is my best friend's favorite essence, Jessica. She loves this stuff, um, so I'm definitely gonna give this a try, and I've never used an essence in my skincare. I am obsessed with Clinique foundation, so I'm gonna give the concealer a try. I don't know if this is my color yet, so I need to figure that out before purchasing. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna get is the Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Lipstick Trio. These are their iconic colors. I am obsessed. I feel like these would be perfect for the holiday to try them out. There's like a reddish, there's like a burgundy, and then a pink one. Their Pillow Talk is in there as well. So I think this is perfect for the holidays to get those like, you know, red, warm, lipstick looks that I'm excited for so I'm definitely gonna get this um so the next thing I'm gonna get is a Too Faced face primer this primer has prebiotic and probiotic skincare ingredients and I'm excited about this I right now probiotic and prebiotic skincare ingredients are my favorite so I'm excited about trying this primer so the next thing that I'm gonna get it is the Dr. Dennis Gross Universal Daily Peels I've heard amazing things about this and I actually tried a tester and I fell in love so I'm picking this up I needed an eyelash curler so I'm getting this tweezer mat and it's also a an allure favorite I'm getting the Olaplex holiday fix kit because I love the Olaplex number three and it's on there so I'm just gonna get that little kit I absolutely love Sunday Riley Good Jeans, so I'm gonna get the big jumbo size. This stuff is amazing. I am currently obsessed with Miranda Kerr, so I am getting her face oil. I love her. I love everything she stands. She eats clean. She just lives literally like my ideal life. She is amazing, and I'm gonna try her face oil. I am gonna try this Dr. Dennis Gross Colloidal Sulfur Mask. This has retinol. And apparently it's really great for an overnight mask, so I'm giving that a try. Uh, the Drunk Elephant Vitamin C Serum. This has mixed reviews. Half the people I know hate it, half the people I know love it, so I'm just going to give it a try. I'm going to get the Dr. Jart Sika Repair Grass. I feel like I want to try this serum because I have their moisturizer, and I feel like this will be better because the serum will seep into my skin better and be more effective because serums actually get in better than moisturizers. I'm gonna try the Gazoo hair oil. I love Negan, so I, I wanna try her hair oil. And I know it's pricey, so no way in hell would I purchase this for full price, so I'm gonna pick it up during the Sephora sale. The next thing I'm gonna get is the Youth to the People Glow Dream Mask. I've heard amazing things about this. It's apparently amazing if you have dry skin, it has vitamin C, it has a lot of like brightening ingredients. I'm gonna use this as an overnight mask or just like a, you know, one of those moments when I, I just need a little pick me up mask. I'm gonna get the, I might get the Drunk Elephant little suitcase thing, I'm not sure. This is like a solid 20% chance that I'm gonna buy this. It's just really pricey and I honestly like a few of their stuff, a few things that they have, so I'm not sure. Some of the stuff I can gift as a like gifts for Christmas but still, I don't, I don't know if I'm picking this up. The next thing I'm gonna get, it is the Milk Makeup Hydro Primer. I'm dying to try this out. I've heard so many amazing things, so I'm gonna definitely pick the mini up. The next thing I'm gonna get is the First Aid Beauty. I love their moisturizer, as I mentioned earlier, so why not get the little kit? It comes in the same price, so this is an amazing kit here, like a uh, Christmas holiday kit here. The next thing I'm gonna get, it is the KNC Beauty Retinol Eye Creams. These ha have retinol in it, and this is definitely something I'm gonna use when I'm pampering myself. I'm sure you've seen these everywhere. They're like a little, like, shooting star. So I'm excited about that. I love warm vanilla scents, so I'm excited to try this Sol de Janeiro Body Mist that everyone's obsessed with, so I'm gonna get the mini. Then the next thing I'm gonna get is the Mario Makeup Palette. I love the colors on here, so I'm super excited about trying this. Okay, so the next two things that I'm getting from Summer Fridays is the Jet Lag Mask and is the AHA Exfoliating Solution. I love the Jet Lag Mask. I feel like it's a must for the winter. I'm definitely picking that up and I'm getting the five ounce one, like the, their big jumbo size that I'm super excited about. I didn't even know they had that. And then I'm not sure, if, I'm actually not sure, 60% chance that I'm gonna get the exfoliating solution. 
but it has niacinamide, AHAs, and a bunch of exfoliating ingredients on there, and I feel like it actually would be amazing. Uh, so I'm definitely excited to try that, but I'm, I'm not sure because I feel like I have a lot of exfoliating like toners and serums that I, I already use, so I don't know if I need this. Okay, so I am picking up the Herbivore Face Jade Roller thing. I know. I know that you don't need this. Like, this is definitely, like, a lot of dermatologists say that you don't really need this. You can use, like, a, a spoon in the morning to depuff your face. But I am, I'm just going to give this a try, okay? I want to know what, what all the fuss is about. So the next thing I'm going to get, it is the Olaplex number zero, the Intense Bond Builder. Apparently, this is supposed to be really amazing. This is their new treatment. I've tried everything from Olaplex, their hair oil, shampoo, conditioner. And so far right now, the favorite, my favorite ones are the hair oil and the treatment number three. And so I'm going to try this treatment number zero and hopefully I will, I like this. Apparently, it works really well and you can use it with the treatment number three as like an intense repair mask so i'm excited about that so the next thing that i'm getting it is the Too faced hangover three in one primer and setting spray i am I, i'm iffy about this because i feel like i'm already getting their primer but i also need a setting spray i don't know i might get one or the other but i'm this is just like a maybe right for now okay so the next thing that i have here it is the peter thomas roth sulfur acne treatment mask i am still 50 50 percent like I'm, i haven't decided if i'm gonna buy this or not but I've heard amazing things about it and it has sulfur in it and I definitely want to start co contributing like uh, sulfur into my routine. All right guys, so these are all of the stuff that I'm picking up during the Sephora sale. I hope that this video was helpful and you know, you have a better idea of what you're gonna pick up during this Sephora sale. I highly recommend, once you know you for sure want something, pick it up because sometimes during the end of the sale, stuff starts to get out of stock or they're like, they no longer have that product. Like towards the end of the last Sephora sale, I had a couple things on my cart that I was just waiting till the very last minute. I don't know why, but eventually everything on there was like out of stock. Like the nurse Jamie was out of stock and I didn't get to get it last time. Honestly, can't think of everything else, but a lot of stuff, uh, I believe like the good jeans was also out of stock. Just a bunch of stuff that I wanted to pick up was out of stock by the end of it. So and once you know, pick it up. All right, guys, so that is pretty much it. I do have a giveaway on my channel. Currently, it is a $100 gift card to either Sephora or Amazon. So if you want to be added to that giveaway, I'll I'll add the video up below. It is my super group collection a review video so that video has the hundred dollar gift card and I highly recommend adding on to that it is um, gonna be announced on Thanksgiving Day that way the winner has a hundred dollar gift card to shop for Black Friday so I am super excited about that so definitely join if that's something that you're interested in but I hope you guys found this video helpful I love you guys so much and thank you ha and happy Halloween bye